Welcome or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'll be showing y'all how I use these straws to make three different DIY projects. All I'm doing in this step is placing the straw up against the glass and cutting it exactly where I want it and then repeating those same steps. I'm removing the sticker from these Dollar Tree vases by spraying them with Windex and then letting it sit for a few minutes. I'm using my steel ruler to scrape it off. I'll be placing this metallic tape on the very bottom and the top of all three vases. Now it's time to place the straws around my bases and I'm only putting glue at the very top and bottom of my straws. I'm only gluing four straws to each side and this is how it looks once I was completely done. And now I'm taking this candle holder and I'm gonna add some more of that metallic tape around the top and also the middle. Next, I'm gluing one of my glass bases on top of this candle holder and then I'm using some of these fake ice rocks to fill all three of my bases. And then I'm gonna add these tea light candles, remove any glue, and then this is how it turned out. I think these candle holders turned out pretty nice. You can't even tell that these are straws. This DIY was very simple, quick, and easy. But tell me what y'all think down in the comments. On to project number two. I'm simply freestyling a design for my wall decor and I'm laying out a foundation first before gluing the other straws that's actually going to hold my wall piece together. So now that the foundation is done, I'm gluing more straws to actually hold the piece together. Now I'm just gluing a few diamond mirror tiles to my wall decor, then I'm going to clean my mirrors off, remove any excess glue strings, and then this is how it turned out. I love how this turned out. Once again, this DIY was very simple, quick, and easy, and you still cannot tell that these are straws. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments. I purchased these mirrors from the Dollar Tree and they are looking a little busted up because I used them in a previous project, but not to worry, I'll be covering the sides with my silver diamond wrap. Next, I'm gluing two straws where each line begins.
Okay, so this part was a little challenging for me because the straws just would not stay in place. But if you are going to recreate this project, then once you put the glue down, you have to hold the straws in place until the glue dries a little bit. By the other side being done, it made it a little bit more easier for me to do this side by myself. This is what I have so far, and to cover up that visible glue, I'm using some of these beaded necklaces. I'm also using some of these acrylic gems to decorate the bottom and the top of my mirrors. Once I was done with that step, I removed any excess glue strings, cleaned my mirrors off, added a push light to the bottom of the top mirror, and then I had something that looked like this. I'm loving how my candle holder turned out, which it can also be used as a perfume holder or whatever your heart desires. Comment below which project you like best. Please like and share. And if you're curious to see what else I can create, Hit that subscribe button and turn on your notifications so you don't miss my next video.